Hey, Loopline here, and I want to go over the backlink checker add-on. So I went ahead and got some URLs here, just scraped up a quick list so I have something to work with. Um, you, if you don't have the add-on installed, you go to add-on, show available add-ons, and then when the list comes up, you can just install the backlink checker or you know update it, that sort of thing. If you already have it installed and or once you do have it installed, simply go to add-ons and go backlink checker. And once the backlink checker loads up, we'll see a few different things, one of which this is going to be proxies, which it'll pull from here. Um, right now it says zero proxies, which is fine because I'm not doing a big run. If you have a lot of URLs, you're going to want to use proxies. Um, as far as bringing in URLs, I'm just going to bring in these ones here in, that are in Scrapebox Harvester, but I can also load them from a list if I wanted to from a file or that sort of thing. So Scrapebox Harvester, bring in those URLs. I'm not going to turn connections up real high. Eight is fine. Now I have two options. You'll see here it'll say backlinks and then status. Backlinks is account. Is a number of backlinks there, and then status is obviously you know the progress as we go through. And then I also have download backlinks. So if I hit start, all it's going to do here is just going to go through and it's going to give me a count of backlinks. So that is the number of backlinks that are registered now the source only lets you download max of 1000 uh, it's not going to let us download all of these backlinks that's just what it has as account for it so but if I just hit start and let it run through here it'll show completed on everything or it failed if it timed out or something something for some reason get down to the bottom and that doesn't actually get the backlinks it just gives you a count of how many backlinks there are so if you needed it for competitive reasons uh, and that sort of thing and so if I want to download backlinks, I can actually just open the add-on, load the list, and I do not have to hit start and actually get the count first. I can just hit download backlinks, find somewhere to save it, I'm just going to call it backlinks, and it'll go through and actually download them. And you can see it's going to go through, and I'm not going to let it run the whole time, we'll just abort it for the sake of it. Um, but then... I have the option to export as a CSV file. And if I do that, that's just exporting the count. That's not actually exporting the backlinks. When I choose download backlinks, I actually choose where to save those. So if I hit start and I get a count, I can export that count um, for analysis. If I download backlinks and it's automatically going to get saved, then let me just pull those up to look at them here. And so I went ahead and just opened them up here. And you can just see that there's just a giant list of backlinks. Uh, that are coming in for the ones that it downloaded before I actually hit abort. And that is how the backlink checker add-on works.